Peace and love, everybody. This is your girl, Titan Sandra Barnes. And now I'm coming back at you all once again to drop some more words of truth and some more words of knowledge. Um, I wanted to share this little piece within this uh, within the uh, morning this evening. For those uh, YouTube subscribers, you feel free to um, subscribe to my page. You know, if you want to hear some words of truth and spoken word pieces. But what I'm going to be discussing with you all on this evening is called mental illness among the black community. You know, it just seems like everybody in the world today, especially among the black people, is just absolutely going nutty out here. You know, it's just really sad a lot of black people out here, you know, just ab absolutely is losing their minds. The dumb shit they doing, you know, killing each other, you know, killing their babies. You know, I mean, just, um, you know, absolutely going, you know, going nutty, you know, killing their own, um, you know, kill, you know, killing off their own kind with the gun violence, with the drugs and the gangs that's flooding in the community. And, you know, they looking at you all strange, looking at you all crazy, you know, but this is just a spiritual warfare. You know, it's just absolutely ridiculous. One minute they talking to you, next minute they look at you like you not nothing. But uh, it's just the mental illness that's going on within their minds. You know, they minds is lost, they lost, they don't know nothing no uh, nothing they don't know nothing about truth anymore. You know, they bleaching their skin, they getting fake booty injections, the women, you know, fake enhancements with their chest, bleaching their skin, doing all this crazy nonsense that's absolutely is just ridiculous. You know, the men bleaching their hair, wearing women purses, they call that a man purse. You know, this just shit is just absolutely ridiculous. You know, they trying to be something they not. You know, doing all this stuff that's um, they thinking it's going to help them. But at the end of the day, it ain't doing them but they're destroying their minds. You know, black folks act like they forgot where they came from, the stuff that they doing. And it's just getting worse about a day. You know, all this nonsense they doing among each other as far as with the killing, with the babies, you know, with the murders and, the, you know, men killing these women and beating on them within these relationships. These women getting beat on, you know, it's just absolutely ridiculous. You know, homosexuality is going rapid. Women turning into uh, lesbians, men turning gay. I mean, this shit is just absolutely ridiculous. You know, they got uh, accepting this homosexuality lifestyle now. You know, they all about transgender, you know, trying to um, gentrificate, uh, gentrify the race among the black community. You know, this is absolutely ridiculous. The drugs that they using, you know, the alcohol they abusing, you know, it's just absolutely ridiculous. You know, it's just sad that black people just don't care no more. They forgot their way of thinking. They forgot their uh, train of thought. You know, the things that they doing, they just allowing it. You know, they sitting back and just let all this stuff go on within their neighborhoods. And they just don't seem to give a damn. You know, I mean, the, the, the situation among the black community in America and worldwide is absolutely ridiculous. You know, all the killings that we see among black people as far as with the children being uh, in, in murdered, you know, and the men, you know, and women and whatnot is just absolutely ridiculous. And they just sit back, do nothing. They all in a in music world fighting and cutting up. You know, it ain't no more real hip hop music. You know, it's all about fighting and, you know, who's better than this one. It's all about just jealousy and envy now and it's just absolutely ridiculous the shit that they doing you know the guys promote nothing but negativity in the rap music the skinny pants all this uh, uh homosexuality in the uh, in the hip-hop world in the movies uh movie world you know just absolutely ridiculous it's just sad that black people just sit back and just let this shit go on within their community and don't do nothing about it the black church is not standing up among each other anymore you know the black leaders are selling out you know taking money you know bro Bribing, you know, people, you know, uh, sexual misconduct, you know, the church is not like what it used to be no more. It's all about these pastors pimping out people in the church. Ain't no real truth being spoken. I mean, come on, black people. What the hell is going on? You all need to wake up. I mean, you know, the things that they allow it to happen because you all have miseducated you all selves and not seeking truth. You all just let all this stuff go on and all this nonsense going in your head and around you and you just sit back and do nothing. You know, ain't no more going to college no more just about, you know, researching and getting information. You know, everybody just all about themselves and just all about getting high, promoting sex and violence and negativity and don't give a damn about nothing about the positivity. You know, just absolutely 
absolutely ridiculous. You know, it's sad to see the black community in, uh, uh, in, in, in shambles like this. And they wonder why the white people and people don't want to be around us because look what we're doing. You know, the minds of us, uh, uh, of the people has really uh, deteriorated. You know, it's all about y'all. Everybody just so depressed and uptight and confused. You know, everybody just so mad at one another. I don't understand how black people can be mad at black people. You all need to be mad at yourselves. The decision that you all made. You know, black people just against black people now. And it's just absolutely ridiculous. You know, it's like the black KKK. Everybody just mad. Everybody trying to outdo one another. Everybody want to be better than the next. All this jealousy among these women insecure and jealous. You know, I mean, it's just absolutely ridiculous. You know, and it's just sad how the black people have just come to the uh, shambles. You know, far as don't know their truth, don't know their history. You know, they actually forgot where they came from. You know, everybody is getting sacrificed, you know, within a, a, a Illuminati. And they just sit back and just let this go on. You know, they just let these people take their money and just go broke. You know, black people is not investing their monies back in the communities. There are hardly no black businesses. There's hardly no black doctors and lawyers and teachers, police officers. You know, just absolutely ridiculous. There's not uh, enough black nurses, you know, that's teaching and that's going to help take care of our uh, uh, men and women and our babies and elderly when they're sick. All these young women nowadays among the black community, it's all about chasing weave and fighting, fighting over these nothing men and getting high. You know, and shaking booty tail. I mean, it's absolutely ridiculous. You know, a lot of these women among the black community is no longer known to be uh, queens. They known to be thots and hoes now, and they proud of it. They proud to be showing off their butt on on the uh, Instagram and on the uh, Facebook. They proud of these guys uh, smashing them, and then they go back and tell the homie, and then one minute you know they name is out there. It's they a lot of these black men proud to be drug dealers. You know, another, another uh, brother in the hood doing nothing with his life. You know, it's just absolutely ridiculous how the black communities worldwide just let their communities go down in poverty and demonic shit with negativity and foolishness and bullshit. You know, it's all about the man and the black people. And it's just really sad to what I, what I see that's going on among our black communities. You know, wake up black people. You know, you all need to get your minds right because the stuff that you all doing is just bringing no more, no more nothing but problems. And you wonder why you all not getting respected because you know, you all not respecting yourself. Y'all not teaching y'all kids how to read and write. All y'all care about is just running the streets and killing people. Wake up, black people, because the end is coming near. You know, y'all better get y'all selves right because they, uh, at the end of the day, it ain't just the white folks and other races killing us. We killing ourselves. Where is the truth?